What we have here is the cooling jacket, which, as we discussed earlier, touches every cell. And since we've begun to open up these clamshells, we can now see where that cooling jacket runs. And there it is there, goes back around, touches these two cells, loops again. And you can see the thermal potting compound is only as high as the cooling jacket itself. On the other end here, which makes it impossible to get this clamshell apart and take it off, there's actual epoxy that is holding the top of these cells to this clamshell here. So splitting this apart and opening it is virtually impossible because you would destroy everything in between doing so. In the day, Tesla had wire bonders and some automation robotics that connected all of these tiny wires in sections to each of the cells. To create a battery pack for each Roadster, they had to create over 26,000 of these battery sheets since each car had 11 inside that large enclosure.